Good morning again. This is Eric, Northwest Bus Sales. Once again, thanks for your time. All right, I do appreciate you giving us a look again. So here we go. What we got is, let's see, 2001 Prevo La Mirage XL 255 passengers. Good looking coach. Now, I've recently put a few more of these online. Look, they're right over there. I'll tell you what, right there they are. We got a couple of them right there, front and back of each other. Those, one of them's an 01 and the other one's a 2000 as well. Uh, let's see, oh, Prevo H345. Got two of those front and back there next to the XL. So check it out, we have got a whole lot of Prevos in stocks. H345s and La Mirage XL2s. All of them 45 foot motor coaches. Here we go, let's get back to this one here. So keep this in mind for your Prevos. Man, I've got, I've got a ton of coaches in stock. I'll get to that here shortly. So before I get started on this thing, I want to give you a heads up. Uh, let, our, our shop right now is backed up with sold buses, trying to get those out for the customers. So we are backed up a bit and I have not, this thing has not been through the service department. We just gave it a quick cleaning. So please keep in mind, it does have its share of shortcomings. Without further ado, here we go. Dual entry grab bars as you come in. Step treads are looking pretty good. I'll tell you what, looking real good. Step well lighting there also. PA system right here. Hello. Hello. Northwest bus sales, Eric here. Check it. All right, it works. All right, driver's seat right here is showing a fair amount of wear right here. We got some, we got some, uh, you know, some fading some uh you know just a high high traffic area right here on the corners it is showing some a fair amount of use we got a rip and tear there ripping and tearing ripping and tearing armrests there also now there like i mentioned has not been through the shop yet so there are some things that are not working on this coach but if it's a concern it's it's something we can definitely take care of uh air actuated tilt and telescoping wheel air horn that Okay, he's gonna make a liar of me. Well, we got a little horn there. Air horn isn't functioning. AM FM radio and REI DVD video system. Driver and passenger heat and AC controls, as you can see. And the control panels there for courtesy lighting and what have you. Driver and passenger heat and AC. Over here on the side, you can see the Allison B500 with a six speed. I love that transmission, can't go wrong with that. It is not the B500R, no retarder, but it does have a jake switch right here. And power and heated mirrors, which I checked out before I started this video. Unfortunately, I hate to say it, the power mirrors are not working, but again, it's something we can definitely check into for you. Pull down sunshades here on the side here for the driver and both front windshields. The windshields are looking pretty doggone good. You know what? I'm not seeing any rock chips, no cracks anywhere, looking really good interior convex mirror right here there we go and uh, oh look we even got a big brother cam right there Ooh, that's a bit old willian don't you think <laughs> all right uh looking pretty good oh check out the mileage while we're right here seven hundred twenty-five thousand. those of you that are coach fans you know that this baby's got a lot of miles left on her don't worry about that 725 that ain't nothing to sneeze at she's got a ton of service left in her all right floor's looking pretty good here around the driver's area e-brake over there air air emergency brake naturally and check out the passenger seating still pretty vibrant color there real vibrant blue Prevo seats right here check it sometimes you'll see Americans or national seating in Prevos but and often Prevo puts their own seats in them too so high back reclining passenger seats with armrests headrests and footrests right down there see that little magazine net right there as well emergency roof hatch right above me front and rear enclosed overhead parcel racks look at here driver's compartment right here there's the rei dvd player right there okay you can see i got a television up front right here enclosed overhead parcel rack racks as i mentioned and one of my favorite things about these xl la mirage is the windows i love the passenger windows i just love how they wrap around the top there really gives it a good look I can dig it. Look at that. The passenger seat upholstery seems to be in good condition. I'm not seeing, I mean, very, very few rips and tears here. Very minimal. You know, obviously some fading and wear 
right here in the high traffic areas. Oh, I also failed to mention this is a wheelchair bus. ADA bus has got a Rikon style cassette wheelchair lift in the third luggage bay underneath. And this door right here opens up. This will accommodate up to two wheelchairs. I'm not going to be able to demo the wheelchair lift for you. I tried to I checked that thing out before I started this video and it is not functioning as I mentioned. It has not been through the shop yet, but I've just got an abundance of motor coaches in stock right now and I and we just really got to get them online. I want all our customers to know what we have available. Row of 3 here in the back, 55 passengers. Another roof hatch up there. Four televisions. You can see the one on the right is not working again. Don't sweat it. I can get that taken care of for you. Restroom in the rear flush toilet and a sink vanity mirror there oh yeah so this would work awesome for like tour charter industry you know that that any any type of application crew hauler employee transport church bus sports team bus i mean we sell these to colleges and universities to accommodate their sports teams and uh, lots of storage underneath as well for all the gear that goes along with it Okay, pardon, uh, pardon the, the wet floor here. It's been raining like a son of a gun today. So, well, that's how we like it up here in the Northwest. So, I got the floor all messed up for you, but I got streaks all over the floor from my wet feet. And uh, let's see, reading map lights right there for the passengers as well. All right. Let's, uh, I think that'll do it for the inside. Nonetheless, getting back to the floor, the floor is in really good shape. I'm not seeing any damage done to the floor. A lot of service left in her. All right, let's cruise around it outside a bit. Here we go. And you got the exterior door switch underneath the second running light right here. You got LED running lights, front, rear, midship, and LED clearance lights as well. Check out the tire tread. That is the passenger front. Good tread there. Underneath right here. Oh, there's the air horns. And which didn't work again. Again, I'm sorry for there, there are some minor equipment flaws here on this thing. Let's check out the under four storage. Here we go. Three under four storage compartments, but this one, I mean, three typically on a La Mirage, but the third one back there is taken up with the Rikon cassette style wheelchair lift. Look at that, a lot of room underneath here. AC condensers and fans and what have you, LED midship lighting right there, and the fuel access door. I would love to tell you the my, or the gallons on that fuel, but man, I just don't know what the capacity is. I want to say it's probably 200, right in there, 190, 200 gallons, something like that. All right. And the driver, passenger side, rear drive tires right there. Look at that, good amount of tread there. Oh yeah. Check out the end of the carriage a bit. seems to be in fair condition. I am seeing some minor dings and scratches, but nothing major. Tag axle right here as well. Fair amount of tread on the tag. Right in there is the master switch in that compartment there. I'm gonna open this up. Well, it looks like the, the door had that open for pictures earlier and it didn't latch again, but pardon me. There's the compressor AC holding tank for the restroom right above cleaner right there, big air filter, big 50 gallon drum, I'll tell you what, they're massive air cleaners. Alright, here, let's open up the barn doors, get a look at the mill. Look at this, I love it! Man! My favorite part, check out that mill. Detroit Diesel Series 60, 12.7! Oh, I'll tell you what. LED clearance lights up top, LED hazards, brake lights, turn signals, getting back that's an inline six cylinder with a turbo. Those things, man, you just rock and roll with those babies. Can't go wrong with a Detroit. I love it. So, uh, here we go. 12.7, as I mentioned earlier, that's 12.7 liters. So that's a big boy. Detroit Series 60 either comes in an 11.1 1 or a 12.7. 12.7 is the most common in motor coaches from my experience, but also I want to say Detroit also makes a Series 60 14 liter or something like that. Don't hold me to it, but 
they put the big dog in the big trucks, you know, the big 18 wheelers. So, but 12 sevens, I think, is the biggest you can get in a motor coach. Still, tons of power. These things will, man, they, they pull like a son of a gun. So, getting back to the tires here on the driver's side. Uh, oh shoot, I thought it was going to give us the capacity, but it doesn't. But nonetheless, it's got driver and passenger side uh, fuel doors there so you can fill up. I also did, I saw a slight blemish here on the on the windows. Looks like we got a scratch up there on the windows. But it's, does, it's not cracked or chipped. It's like, I don't know, they got into something, I'll tell you what. But still looking really good. I love the windows on the La Mirage. Mm. Very good, very good. Oh, I missed the front drive tire, or driver's side front tire. LED running lights, as I mentioned earlier, all the way around, good tire tread, all the way around as well. All right, I think it'll, I think that'll do it for this baby. 2001 Prevo La Mirage XL2. I have got a pile of Prevos in stock. Look at these Ds, DLs, D3s, DL3s, D4500s. I got D4000s, EL3s, E4500s, A3s, AW3s, MC12s, MC9s, doggone commercial buses, school buses, shuttles, new uh, Type A school bus. You can see one over there. That Bautista limo is impressive. That is a nice looking coach. And a little limo van right there. Sell pending on that one. And uh, let's see. Big F. 650 new StarCraft F650 XLT over there. 36 passengers with a massive rear luggage. You can see some school buses over there as well. More Prevos, H345s, XL2s. I've got a couple Van Hool C2045s in the back that haven't made it through the shop yet. Uh, like I said, shop's all backed up with sold buses, but we will get these babies dialed in for you and we can meet all your bus needs, parts, service, you name it. Northwest bus has it. All right, I think that'll do it. 2001 Prevo La Mirage XL 255 passenger ADA lift will accommodate up to two wheelchairs. I think you'll lose about eight to ten seats though inside. Uh, check us out online nwbus.com. Please call with any questions. 800-231-7099. Thanks.